Hi girls and guys, today I've decided to show you guys two spreads on my normal sketchbooks uh, just because I'm trying to fill them up and I do work on them almost on a daily basis but I did not realize that I didn't show you guys anything around it and uh, well, I just decided to take you guys on a journey with me and this way you get more videos of me doing stuff so uh, first, I do want to tell you that I work on different sketchbooks at the same time um, these two sketchbooks that I'm showing you guys today are two A4 sized sketchbooks that are just plain normal paper and one of them is mainly for birds and plants and animals in general and the other one is for um, portraits and faces and human figure and just me trying to figure out um, my style anyways um, as you can see here I'm working with a red pencil and some India ink and for the India ink I'm just using the same bamboo stick that comes inside the bottle itself and I'm working on an art creation by talents sketchbook these ones are just plain paper and they're quite cheap and I like to work on them just because they're easy and they're the easiest to work around um, I will try to show you guys some of my sketches on a normal watercolor just because this is not supposed to be for watercolor well actually I do use them mainly for colored pencil and just to do color swatches and pens but I've decided to actually show you guys how I play around with it about the sketches that you see, actually, no, what I normally do is I just go to my Instagram feed and whatever I like, whatever plants I like, or my Pinterest feed, and I just paint and sketch whatever I see. The first thing that comes through when I scroll, that's the first thing I paint, just because I'm trying to understand shape and color more than anything. Um, I actually do try to work a little bit on value but not this time just because I'm I'm still getting accustomed to things now what I normally do is after I've placed a few layers of colored pencil when I work with color pencil I take some paint solvent the one that I use for oil paints and I just go over it with over the color pencil with some brushes and then I continue coloring to give it more uh, vibrancy without having to use the darker colors just because I prefer to use the light pencils to actually learn value uh, rather than just using darker colors so here's one and this is my second sketch book this is also an art creation and it's the one I use for portraits now normally when I use watercolor of course the paper is not made for it so it gets warpy and wrinkly so what I do is I just skip a few pages and in a few days time I will just go back to that page apply some gesso to it and just use my acrylics so once again here I start with the same colored pencil it's a normal one and I just do the sketches until I'm more or less okay with it and then I go over the lines that I actually prefer with uh, India ink and the bamboo stick. So I will just continue uh, making a few sketches. Normally I use my Pinterest feed and just look at normal random people's faces and I just paint them. It tends to be mostly girls. I do sometimes however get to paint kids and men and old men but it's mainly girls. So uh, as you can see I don't pay too much attention both spreads of this sketchbook together took me uh, less than an hour I think it was 56 minutes so normally what I do is I just don't pay too much attention when sketching just because I'm trying to learn and it's just to get my hands accustomed and ready for a bigger painting uh, right now most of the paintings I'm working on are oil paintings and they take forever so I've decided to just upload a few of these videos because they're easy and fast to edit and upload. I hope you guys like them and I guess I'll upload some more of these. Bye!